Hurricane Michael, several agencies and charities came to help Panhandle residents after that monster storm in 2018. Flash forward to Hurricane Ida last month and some Bay County Sheriff's deputies saw an opportunity to return the favor to our friends in Louisiana. News 13's Emily McLeod is live in studio tonight. Emily, those deputies have returned from St. Charles Parish. What did they say about that experience? Amy, the sergeant I spoke with today says everyone in Louisiana treated them well and adds their experience from Hurricane Michael helped them to be able to address the needs of the people in the Bayou State after Hurricane Ida. Days after Hurricane Ida, BCSO deputies were sent out on a nearly two-week deployment to Louisiana to help with recovery efforts. Bay County Sheriff's Deputy Sergeant Jared Turner says he remembers driving into darkness that first night. There was no street lights, no power. Um, you know, all the businesses, you could tell the locations that had generators. Uh, you know, their individual little houses had, were, were lit up, um, but for the most part, you couldn't see a whole lot of anything. A site Turner says he remembers having gone through Hurricane Michael. Yeah, well, it was, it's uh, kind of familiar to the sense that, you know, be, having been here after uh, Hurricane Michael, you know, everything being dark, certain houses being lit up, same thing with the generators. Uh, we knew kind of what we were getting into at that point. Everything was, was blacked out and dark. Turner says the damage couldn't be seen until the next morning during their 5 a.m. shift briefing at their base camp in an elementary school parking lot. The school was damaged like you would see some schools around here, uh, you know, roof down. Um, it had obviously been uh, flooded. They had brought those big machines in to, to try and remedy some of the damage that was inside of it. Turner says the most impactful part of the deployment was helping people get back to a little bit of normalcy. We were uh, getting people into the food distribution areas, being able to hand the food out, um, getting them directions to get, you know, be able to get there, uh, you know, clearing the, clearing the trees, clearing the roadways, people can get around, um, you know, trying to get people back into the grocery stores, the, the Walmart, places where they could actually get uh, the things that they needed, uh, you know, immediately afterwards. Sergeant Turner says the people thanked the deputies for coming and asked if they wanted to stay longer. He adds they were well taken care of during their time in the Bayou State.